anyway, hey, thanks for thanks for tuning in. Thanks to uh, Marvel and the good folks uh, over at Marvel Midnight Sun, Marvel's Midnight Suns, for sponsoring the stream. Right? That's crazy. I've already been playing, and they were like, D "Would you do it on stream?" And I was like, "I would." I'd show you my my other character, but I can just show you in character creation when we get there. Um, the way the game starts is you start as, uh, and I'm not, I'm not gonna spoil it. I'm not gonna spoil it. Hey, welcome. Thanks for thanks for stopping by. Thanks for joining me on this little adventure of ours. Can't wait to see what's what's about to happen. Um, I'll try and show you some of the cool moves that I know we can do. And uh, are there spoilers from the movies? No, no, there are no spoilers from the movies. Yeah, if you want to, by all means, do exclamation point Midnight Suns. Or maybe I just put exclamation point Midnight Sun. We'll find out. I'm going to have to change the thing. But I hope I wrote Midnight Suns, because that would be awkward. Yeah, Midnight Suns. All right, I'm, I'm right. Okay, let's do this thing. New game. Um, Normal's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play tutorial? Sure. Launch campaign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll start it fresh. There's no reason for me. Where I'm at in the story, you would be like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> so I got you. Don't worry. Hey, it's me. I'm a big guy. And I'm walking. Hey, Hell Hydra. Oh, how much I hate this hocus pocus nonsense, Faustus. Now you want to tell me just what the hell is so important? Sleeping mother. Sacred harbinger. Awaken and reclaim what is yours. You who rise with the moon in darkness. Who prepares the path? It's always Hydra, you're right. It's always Hydra. Sun. Turn your merciless eyes upon us and arise! Nice show, Doc. Next time, call Zemo. Better yet, I'll just shoot you and save us all the trouble. I love they name drop Zemo, that's fun. Shout out to all these ladies who are like, I wonder what's in the box. Oh! And dead. <laughs> Oh, these guys? Dead. My favorite part about that cutscene is you notice she, the main, the characters that have names, she didn't go for. Lilith knows what's up. If they got a name, you can't kill them. They're the main cast. Lessons learned, everybody. I can feel it, Rox. This Trouble is pretty cool. I love this. Also, some blood joining you soon. incoming best goof in the entire game. Head back to your magic castle. You ain't welcome here. Incoming best goof. The game has a lot of goofs. This one's my favorite it's one. It's called a sanctum. And welcome or not, this is where fate has determined the Sorcerer Supreme needs to be. Tell fate answers no. This is the secret guardian you dragged me 5,000 miles to meet? Who's the mouth? Mr. Stark is brash, but I assure you, he can be trusted. Incoming Wait. goof. You seriously don't know who I am? The fabric of magic is shifting, Johnny. The prophecy of the Midnight Sun is upon us. Your last crusade cost me plenty. 
This time, I intend to look after my own. Hey, pal, I don't think you understand. Things are changing. Two plus two no longer equals four. Up is sometimes down, and strange here is actually starting to make sense. Do I look like someone who gives a damn about any of that? No, you look like you should be bouncing for the double deuce. Listen, all I know is hell's coming, and my pal here says you can help. That's where you're wrong. Hell's not coming. It's already here. You're welcome, Robo Man. And. And. Uh, Iron Man. That's such a good goof. That's really funny. It's okay. It's fine. <laughs> I know what he meant. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Hey! We come all the way out here, and the old man runs okay. off with that precious page of yours. Yeah, I know how to play. Okay. Yes, yeah, I'm aware how to play. The carnival. One of a few monsters on the way out. Johnny Blaze has sacrificed a great deal for this world already. I am certain that he will come. Out. Well, she said time was the one thing we didn't have. Uh, all right, let's just wrap this up. I got about sand in my nanopolymer weed. Nothing personal. Okay, maybe a little personal. Am I really gonna have to bring out the big guns for this? Hey, hey, here comes the fun. Let's do it. That was really something. I love this kind of gameplay style. This whole XCOM y vibe. Let's proceed then. Super chill, that super fun. I love this kind of stuff. Of yeah, this game is. No match for the mystic arts. I, me to demonstrate. I haven't I'll played the, the entire now. game, then you take the but the story's like, one. all right. Glad the gameplay you. is awesome. I love the way this game plays. It's super fun. Later on, I'll show you some of the cool stuff you can do. This is just the tutorial. But maybe I can show you now. Can we knock back this guy into... Let's see what happens. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Uh... Okay. Big fan. Big fan. I truly doubt they're paying you enough for what's about to happen. The story is better than like the last four Marvel movies. Well, most of the recent Marvel movies have not been the best, but like, it's all good. Um, hit him with the axe. Good oosh. Yeah, the combat is great. This game, I have so much fun playing. isn't enough to scare off these so-called children of Lilith. Leave that man alone! Me down that easily, fiend. They haven't given up yet. Probably still won't be enough, but you can try. Now that I have their attention, perhaps a blessing is in order. Something protective? Well, I could give you a hand, or a shield in this case. In the spirit of cooperation, I'll accept your offer. Just to this uh, Don't mention it. Nano machine, son. Okay, can I? No, the knockback's not gonna work on this dude, but it will work on this guy. I did forget about Black Panther two. I liked Black Panther two, but I, it's mostly because I like Namor. Namor was fire in that movie. Black Panther, like. Angela Bassett, fire. Uh, M'Baku, fire. Namor, fire. But the rest of the movie was like, all right. I, 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 I'm disappointed that, like, I liked Namor as much as I did, and it was like, he's, all right, I guess he's the bad guy. <laughs> Namor was great. Namor was cool as shit. Let's give it a go. Lilith doesn't care about you. I hope you realize that in time. Their 
not quite ready to oh damn you. there's so many of them what are we ever gonna do honestly now you're just wasting your time i think we pissed them off got a spell for that maybe damage every enemy will it kill these guys change the very no it will not kill them okay something along the lines of the psionic I like the first Black Panther movie. I thought that was great. I uh, Shang Chi absolutely loved it. I think there's some, you know, there's some problems, but thought it was great. Um, what came out the last phase? I can barely remember half the movies that came out. Are you, are you for real? Really? Okay. This shouldn't take long. I like Spider-Man. I thought Spider-Man was great. Spider-Man was, Thor Love and Thunder, I was not a fan of. I think it went too far comedy. Like, I think Ragnarok was like a nice sweet spot, but Love and Thunder was a little, they like said, you know what it was? Thor Love and Thunder is the exact same problem I have with Guardians 2, where they let the director like run wild. And I feel like at a certain point, it lost what the movie was supposed to be. If that makes any sense. Yeah, whatever. But with that said, I do a Marvel podcast, so I'm like, you know. Bless the effort. Yeah, that didn't do a damn thing. And while you ponder arrows, maybe we should just try throwing a big rock at you? Ooh, maybe we will. Maybe we will. <laughs> Shit's so good. The way you can use stuff in the world is like just a treat. I'm saving my energy till we need it. This should be good. Boink. Big fan. Big fan. Yeah, I love the combat in this game. Like I said, I haven't gotten far enough into the story to give you, like, what I think of the story. But if I it does honest, have an intro that, like, just win. goes. So I, I think it assumes you know about Marvel characters. So it's not like a lot of story at the beginning. You shouldn't eat spicy food, Bruce. Localized in the West Village, converging on the Sanctum. Wanta. Wanta. The collective works of Her the outfit looks great in this game, by the way. Sorcerers, and he left them underneath the takeout menus. <sighs> Shifting mystical polarities are wreaking havoc on my portals. You don't say. You okay, kid? Yes. You. Let's uh, put a pin in that. Oh. Carol. Bruce and I have been trying to reach you. He'd have come himself, but he's. Well, you did the big. I know that now. voice. I really showed up my homeowner's insurance. Yeah, He's Erica Lindbeck, just the being amazing as usual. If you please, Stephen, I can fight. I've got control now. Then show me by activating the wards. In the meantime, in honor of our missing companion, the rest of you may feel free to smash away. All right, I'm gonna see if I can pull this off. I think I have to do the. Uh, more than that, I'm afraid. I think I have to nice do one, the. Carol. Things. The direct approach. You know I don't mess around. Besides, we picked up some crazy gamma readings coming from, well, here. Guessing that explains the Hydragoons oh, and ominous making green me do lights. Stuff? Yes, but not mm -hmm. why you failed to use the front door. Um, hi, how about we discuss proper hero landing etiquette after we Actually, take I don't want to do that. I want, what I want to do is... How am I gonna pull this off? Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. They're not gonna let me. Tutorials! Tutorials! 
that'll work. These aren't just your normal goons. Boy, I don't want to do this because it's going to ruin... I have a setup of what... Having played this before, I have a setup of what I want to try and do. But maybe... Maybe I can... It's all right. It's fine. Watch closely. I have a, I have a, I have a vision of what I want to show you, but we'll see. I think more guys show up. Even the mother of demons is forced to rely upon hired hands. Redraw. Yeah, okay. Working on it, cheese and crackers. All right. Reverend service. I'm gonna melt your face if you keep that up. All right. All right. Okay. I think I can work with this. They haven't put up much of a fight. Yet. Moving your heroes. Great. Yes. Move Tony Stark to here. Gotcha. I know what I'm doing. Shoot. I know what I'm doing. I've been done this before. Tony Stark is gonna move here. Um. Kick this! Don't mind the Fado! Uh, is that gonna hit all of them? I guess it's gonna hit those two, huh? Come on, even though you want to give me the little space right there, you know, it's not going to work. But maybe... Shut up. Shut up. Is it worth it? Do you see what this is doing? Do you see it's going to hit the guy way in the distance? Do you see this? Shut up. This is, this is the plan. Shouldn't have pissed me off. <laughs> Hell yes! Hell yes! <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes! Now that was beautiful. Oh man. Um, draw the last two attacks played. Oh, I can wait for that. Okay. Uh, let's do a jab. Fair enough. And then let's do a blast. I should talk to your union rep. I don't think you're supposed to be fighting on our level yet. And then, by the way, I don't know if you can see it, but Wanda's like in the back. There she is. She's back there, like hanging out. I think that's pretty neat. Okay. Uh, it's the knockback. We can just do this, but that's mm, mm, it's fine. We'll do this. Not bad. Not great, but. Not bad. You leave him alone, you saw my gun. They just don't know when to quit. Ah, uh, here we go. Here we go. Big time plays. Big time plays. Keep showing up. Carol. They are surprised. Carol, I'm gonna need you to come right. In the event, we must provide Wanda the time here. she needs oh to activate God. the wards of protection. Come right here. How am I gonna pull this off? And then I'm gonna need you to photon beam. Mwah. Mwah. Two knockbacks, huh? Can I get a redraw on this? I'll take it. We'll hit this guy. Not a problem. 
hope you learned your lesson. All right. Double my heroism, huh? Maybe. Here we go. We're very heroic. Right, the odds. That didn't really do. Attack. <laughs> didn't really. You did not just shoot Captain Marvel with a gun. Do you really believe that will be enough? Doesn't seem to be easier. Those star cruisers that went down faster. Something's up. Yes, Hydra has clearly raised their game. And I have a terrible suspicion as to how. The wards. Something's blocking them. Not something. Someone. Oh, hey, what's up? Spectral evil mommy. Gozer? Lilith. Mother of demons. Harbinger of the midnight sun. <laughs> That's a good line. Prophecy or not, you overstep. Challenging the Sorcerer Supreme. Be silent. Be still. What just happened? Ow. Be gone. No! A fellow daughter of Transia. Well done, Miss Maximoff. Your unique energy surprised her. Whoa! I'm fine. What? I'm fine. The prophecy is in motion. Lilith is still out there growing stronger each second the midnight sun approaches. Define stronger. If we are to have any chance of stopping her, there is only one option left to us. I won't go back there. We all must eventually face our demons, Miss Maximoff. However, one of us should remain behind to maintain the wards of protection. See you on the other side. Yeah, they kind of like jump right into the story, and I feel like... If you're not a big Marvel fan, you'd be like, what the hell? But as a Marvel fan, I'm totally fine. I'm like, all right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's get to the meat and potatoes, which is coming up. Yeah, because right here, they introduce us to a ton okay. of characters. You did that one on and they're like, yeah, 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 all right. Magic is unwinding. We are fortunate to be here at all. And where is here, exactly? Salem, Massachusetts. Well, a pocket dimension in Salem, Massachusetts. Oh, suburbs. Nice. Welcome to the Abbey. Home of the Midnight Sun. Hey! There's my boy Blade, and I guess Nico, but mostly Blade. What the hell is this? Lilith's Junior Demon League? Wait, it's that jerk from TV. Which one? Now, if everyone would just take a moment... Enough! Magic's like, all right, but Blade, though. You're standing on my flowers. Oh, been a long time, Sarah. It's caretaker now. If I could have avoided this moment, I would, but... Oh, spare me the speech. Yes, Robbie's there, too. They, that's... Back. We are sisters, after Robbie's a good all. boy, but also Blade. <laughs> Guess we're suddenly invisible now. Shall we chat? Who is Steven? that voice actor? Who's the voice actor for Nico? No one can argue that the hunter earned their rest in the first battle against Lilith. I only hope they are up for the task once more. You wizards always make everything sound so lofty. I raised my sister's only child as a weapon against her. And saved the world in the process. The lady that played her in the live action? Is that true? 
and ask them to do it again. That's cool as shit. I did not write the prophecy, Sarah. Besides, I am no common grave robber. We are simply reuniting their ethereal essence with their corporal form. Speaking of, it would help to have a mental image for the procedure. Spare no detail. Spiritual identity theft is no laughing matter. Yes, there's character creation. It happens right now. That was the tutorial. This is where you actually make your character. Now, I'll show you the character I made. Shouldn't come as any surprise. I went uh, green. I went... It doesn't matter, I guess, what it looks like. Like, it shouldn't come as any surprise the character that I made. Um, but for this, we're making Nick Cage. All right, we need to find the right Nick Cage face. This more question is face A or D more Nick Cage? D seems D seems like a Nick Cage voice. Right, I think so. I think so. You know what? I'm just gonna All right, Nick Cage and Con Air. Perfect. Alright. Now that I have this. He's pretty, he's like uh he's got like a little He's got a little little shade to him. He's got a little like, yeah, yeah. This is the photo. Oh shit. Okay, Nick Cage. He's got a little like. He's got also like kind of a like a. I don't know, man. He's got like kind of a thing going on there. So he's a little lighter. That works. Eye color. My man's eyes are a little blue. Nicholas. Okay. Hair? No. Uh, well, let's see. What's his vibe? No, it's not. We need, like... <laughs> Holy shit. That might be it. That might be it. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. We got no hair. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Lord Farquaad, what are you doing here? Uh, I mean, that's pretty fun, but no, no. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. That could be it. Although, he needs to be a little more balding, to be honest. Oh, see, this one's very good for Nick Cage. This already seems like a good Nick Cage look because his hair is like back already he's got like kind of a he already has like a vibe here i gotta change the hair color <sighs> this this <laughs> that's a little too white uh yeah this is nick cage brown i think or this this is more nick cage brown but the rest of him is like a different color oh, that's so weird He's got like that, and then facial hair. Always oh, got a little stubble going on. That's clearly James Franco. I don't want James Franco. Fine. You know what? Nick Cage. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> now this. Now this is the hair. I don't want, I want Nick Cage. I don't want skin tone. Still too dark for Nick Cage. <laughs> I absolutely love this hair. I can't even lie. I love this hair. <laughs> I love this hair. This guy, full, this guy is, this guy's a, you know what? This is confirmed character. This is my hero now. This is it. This is it.
child of light and darkness. This guy's about to raise up like oh! who came the night. Yes! Look Here at those glorious the locks. Who beseech the end. The caller! Wait! Yes! Look at his hair! This guy is a hero. As far as resurrection spells are concerned, I've seen worse. Yes! <laughs> yes! Tony, come on. It's perfectly safe. That thing wakes up and takes a bite out of you. Don't blame me. Visiting hours are over. You can't stay here forever. There's nowhere else I should be. Just saw that Stark guy poking around behind the mirror table. Find me as soon as they awaken. And Blade, be nice. Shout out to Blade for just being the best, always. Ooh. Some sort of midnight sun. Amazing. So cold. But the air burns with every breath. Has it been so long? <laughs> Never was there more a beautiful character. <laughs> I know this place. In my dreams, it was always empty. I've never been so proud of the character creation in my time. <laughs> but now I sense I am not alone. Have to admit, Hunter, you make one hell of an entrance. Have to admit, Hunter, your hair is fabulous. Guess that makes two of us. You should have struck when you had the chance, vampire. You will not live to regret your error. Cute, and caretaker told me to be nice. Relax, Slayer. I'm a friend. You just don't know it yet. Yes, I saw you with Sarah before. But what would she want with a vampire, unless... The name's Blade. Hell and yeah. I'm no ordinary vampire. Hell yeah. I get you've been out of commission, but I thought you noticed since we're having this little showdown under the freaking sun. A dampier. Daywalkers were a myth, even to me. Says the half-human, half-demon monster hunter. <laughs> You're right, I do hunt monsters. I do. And last I checked, vampires are Yeah, monsters. let's go! <laughs> you want to take a run at me? You can try it. But I got my name for a reason. <laughs> I've probably killed more vampires than you've ever seen, hero. <laughs> Such fighting spirit. No wonder caretaker chose you. Right. As much as I love the, every you, angle, the hair gets better. Can go. Every you angle, the hair is just moving. like. Agreed. The prophecy is in motion. I can feel it. We have wasted too much time here already. Man, the others are really going to love you and your fabulous this... hair. Yeah, you got a little fan club, I think. But why spoil the surprise? Hope you're up for the challenge, chosen one. <laughs> that hair, the hair makes a statement. I can't believe wherever I go, I get to look at this. this <laughs> also, if I had a key, I could come back here and unlock this, but I very much don't. But I did discover a rare chest, so look at me. 
Also, shout out to playing this on mouse and keyboard. Running down the path to my little tiny chateau of midnight suns. Maybe he's born with it. Maybe it's demonic. <laughs> did I miss something? Or did Nico just raise the dead? I hey, definitely hi. helped, but no. That's the one thing I can't do. You were never able to raise the dead. Huh? But she just did. Maybe the hunter wasn't all dead. <laughs> Some part of them had to be alive, otherwise my spell wouldn't have done anything. Which makes sense, I guess. Sounds like I love his hair. I love it. Hunter. Not sure if you remember me, but we met briefly before. I'm... The witch who called me back from the grave. Told you. Or Nico, but neither works. And this is... Robbie Ray is. Yo, Robbie! Oh, man. Never thought I'd be standing next to you. Got quite a rep. I mean, caretakers told us stories. About your hair, That's specifically. That's Liliana. Brilliant. And I think you already met Blade. Of course. Caretaker has reformed the Midnight Suns. Well, how did you... Your power. I can feel it. I always do. My hair can sense your power. So, welcome home. I guess we... I never left. <laughs> right. This man well, is the most gorgeous man who ever lived. The Abbey is still, well, you know. The Abbey. Basic stuff. Dorms, war room, library, a few places to chill, and, uh, whatever the hell the forge is. I have to say, for a haunted transient castle raised on the cursed grounds of Old Salem, it's pretty cozy. Of course, that doesn't stop us from adding some improvements. We can all thank Robbie for the Wi-Fi. Oh, and one more thing. We've got some new house guests now. You think we're a fun bunch, just wait until you meet them. Speaking of, we're here. His hair is so yeah, beautiful. Spend ten minutes in this place alone, Bruce. Then see. Oh, gotta go. Just about to begin. Oh, hello. Before I go to any table, I think we can. Oh. Coven of witches from across the sea is sent for our help. I regret that I cannot do more, but Luth and I are stretched to our limits. Right. I've sent the Moon Seal to their home in Salem by way of Knights of Wondagore. Shout out to the Knights of Wondagore. And tell that You guys having a conversation? Crazy day, huh? Let's go around looting stuff. Is that cool? We have moved the Abbey from our transient home to Salem. And I must confess, I'm astounded at the natural beauty of this place. Yep. But how powerful? We will see. Yes, arcane knowledge. I'm so knowledgeable. I think you mean big egos. I think you mean big head boos. Also, this artwork. <laughs> oh, come on, fellas. Come on, I was just goofing. You don't got to take me nowhere. Ow, stop hitting me. Artwork. It's about interpretation. It's all subjective. I'm running around. <laughs> me not that kind of orc. I can't remember if there's something out here. Is there a lore tidbit out here? No, there is the ocean, though. Hmm. Hmm. I know around over here is another box that I can't open. Story of my life. Oh, also, hello, statues. Oh, yeah, lore statues, my favorite. Fascinating. Jeremiah Kane, breaker of chains. Ah, Will Walker, son of this land. Interesting. Yelena Nikovich believed the best and made it so. And Andra Moore, our fighter of heart. Yeah, here's the chest that I can open. 
Ooh, hello, damsel. You have collected a masterwork in addition to the paintings already hanging in the abbey walls. Masterworks can be found scattered around the abbey grounds. I can hang it in an empty frame. So basically, this is your base of operations, and as you play through the game, you will uh, unlock all sorts of conversations and things with the team, and you can become like best buddies with them. The and sure, you're probably yours. thinking, Jesse, Let's get to it. can you date Blade? No, I'm so sorry, you can't date Blade. But I'm not telling you can't write a fan fiction about it. Six hours, Just put it out there. Eight seconds and counting. Bouncing off each other like an old man. Yeah, I know. I can't date Blade. It broke my heart too. But sometimes in life, you gotta play on your what console is this? Oh yeah, the Nin Station Box. Yep, that's a terrible console name. Good work, Jesse. You really racked your brain on that one. <laughs> yeah, they play the Ouya 2 here. Yep, that's it. Now you can run through here and do all the different things. You know, I gotta explore. I can't remember what's open right now, to be honest. TBH. Oh, yeah. Fire Rod. Ember Swirl. I'll take that. I can't remember what's open and what's not. Ooh, cards. Ah, oh, that's right, strength. I know somewhere around here is also Moon Knight's card. Wherever the hell that is. Try to remind myself, 16 is a young age uh, for so much power. But I still lose my temper at times. This child, nearly grown, is rapidly progressing. The training goes well. I'm optimistic for the future, but guess what? Surely Lilith won't come and do some damage. It should be fine. Yes, I made the most fabulous hair a man could possibly have. And frankly, thrilled. Thrilled. Alright, so this is this. Where the absolute hell is the... I can't go in here. Where are you at, Moon Knight card? Why don't I have the... Alright, so we got my bag for punching. I can't continue until I find this card, because the one thing I remember, it's the first thing I found when I originally played, and I'm now I'm like obsessed over the fact that I can't find it. Moon Knight, where are you? Oh, I can go down to the grotto. Yes, we have a grotto here. What a <gasps> Water Rod, nice. But that's no Moon Knight. Where is this card? Conchu knows where it is. I bet Conchu does. The guy's an asshole. Oh, is it down by the forge? You're gonna make his kid jealous. Here it is. Moon Knight! Of course. That's that cluttered with some books. Something. That is something, Matt Mercer. Intriguing. A chest with some vials and stuff. Floating candles. Curious. That's Doctor Strange's cape. You gotta get the arcane knowledge in your body. That's that the Orb of Agamotto. I think over here is Tony's. Yeah. That's an Iron Man suit. Oh, yeah, all that science in my brain. Hey, the star, nice. I don't know who this Nova guy is. I hope it turns out to be important in some way. Can we date the cape? Um, I'm going to say yes. You know what? I'll allow it. I'll allow it. Okay, let's go back. Ooh, where did I end up at? Oh, wrong way, brain. Hello? I mean, technically, you were here first, but don't expect any special treatment. Caretaker will have you mopping the floors and hauling trash whether you're two or two hundred. But have you seen my hair? I'm calling it now. You two are going to be best friends before this thing is over. 
No signs of muscle atrophy. You seem pretty healthy for a reanimated corpse. You sure you're not a time-traveling robot? It's almost impossible to imagine the horror, the atrocities committed on these grounds all those years ago. Then again, we are less than 20 miles from Fenway Park. I must admit, Hunter, having studied the tomes and read of your exploits in the past, it had never occurred to me that we might someday face Lilith together. I need you to know that no matter what you think, I have not listened to any of it because I have only been focusing on my hair. Should have the world saved in less than a fortnight. Prophecies be damned. It's good to see that face again. You look like it was yesterday. And you look older. You How shouldn't be allowed to make the hair that, that big. Trip, Sarah? No more than a few centuries. You were missed. Centuries? And what of Lilith? Fallen by your hand. Until now. <clears throat> yeah, so speaking of Lilith. Tony? What? The kid's literally speaking of Lilith. Tony. That's my name. Tony. That's, uh, Carol and Dr. Spooky over there. Here to help. Help with what, exactly? Oh, I don't know. Throwing the magic amulet into the volcano? <coughs> Smiting the dragon mother? You tell us, kid. You are the chosen one, after all. Do you recall anything of that last encounter, child? There was... a voice. The rest is hazy. Oh, a voice. That's it? A voice? That's what we have to go on? Results of your long crypt sleep, most likely. A minor inconvenience. Everything required to restore those memories is contained within my sanctum. I will simply alert Wanda to prepare the necessary rituals. Straight to voicemail? Some sorcerer supreme. Must be mystical interference caused by this little pocket dimension of yours. Perhaps Agatha can help. Allow me. A lot of. Whoa, what kind of network you run in there? The all seeing eye of Ereshkigal who oh. judges. Bound to enchant in Babylonian soul glass. We just call up the mirror table. Wanda! The dark portal pushing against the wards. Stephen, where are you? That's impossible. Nothing on Earth could possibly affect those wards. Wanda's in trouble. Wanda is trouble. I'll go. You yes, let's go, help, Blade! Wars. Then let us make haste, Dr. Spooky. Our hunt begins now. I get one gamma coil common. Well, of with course I'll take going it. everything on right now, we simply cannot afford to so You're telling me uh, it's me, Doctor Strange and Blade on a mission together? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all right with that. Yes! <laughs> yes! Now this is a badass team. <laughs> now this is a badass team. Let's go! Let's go! Even given the fluctuations in the astral spectrum, I should be seeing something. Are you ready? The prophecy of the Midnight Sun does not linger, and neither should we. Lilith possesses the dark hold. If she forced her way into my Sanctum Sanctorum once, I suspect she can do it again. You are a Sorcerer Supreme. Can you not predict her movements? Normally, yes. But since your mother breached the Sanctum, my sense of the future has grown voluminous in nature. Is that another language, or...? Ah, <sighs> fuzzy. My predictions are fuzzy. 
For the first time as Sorcerer Supreme, I cannot foresee how the future unfolds, and with my apprentice in danger, we cannot tarry. Your sanctum will survive. We shall see to that. Indeed. <laughs> Yay! Plus one heart! Yes, 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 yes. He loves me, is what I'm saying. That issue with the zoning commission. But this time, it feels different. I do not doubt Wanda's capability, but without my predictive acumen, I cannot bolster the wards should she need it. Still, the wards are woven into the Sanctum's very essence. They should hold. In any case, all will be revealed with time. I suggest we make use of it while it still functions. Friendship we XP plus one, as dog. Much as I'd love to hear a first-hand account of your exploits. Time is of the essence, I'm afraid. Can I hold on? Can I go back in and talk to people? Are they gonna give me points of love? How many points of love can I earn before I go on this mission? Wanda can maintain the ward, I'm certain of that. Nico, what's going on with you? Return to path? Oh my ass. Well, lesson learned. That about hair is time. brilliant. Not just about time, Mr. Brooks. Time, space, reality, the building blocks of magic. All must be constant for my portals to work properly. Yet as we now know, that is no longer the Did case. Did magic just look to camera when he said the word magic? Several times. Otherwise, I would still be hunting dread maidens in my sleep. Indeed. And while I certainly appreciate the view of this vista, I fail to see how it will hasten our return to the sanctum. Magic is the answer. No, as I've just stated, magic is the problem. Who's on first? Your magic is. Doctor Strange. Not ours. The ground you are standing on exists within two worlds. A mystical anchor point to Ileana's realm that allows her to... Well... I'll just let her show you. She doesn't have to be this cool, right? They know that, right? To limbo, baby. Tinge of impatience. It is my home under. I don't care what Strange says. I'm only going to the sanctum to give Wanda some backup. This should be an easy warm. Wanda belongs here. Bring her back safe. You're standing. What a himbo enters limbo. Nexus of all realities, both real or. Otherwise, a chaotic but secret realm beyond the influence of Lilith, the far. Are you certain of that? Because I am sensing all kinds of dark energy. That feeling you're being watched. General Hellho vibe? Yes. All these potentialities converging at once? A truly surprising feat, Miss Rasputin. For someone so young, of course. You think this is crazy? Wait until you see Manhattan. That's actually pretty funny. That's very true. A dude who's been asleep for hundreds of From years here, sees a big city. He'd be like, "What the?" Just about anywhere on our planet and beyond. We don't want to risk punching through the wards protecting your sanctum, Doctor. So we've chosen a safe exit. Of how dare you say that my hairdo that I personally selected is ugly? How dare you? How dare you? Hey, I'm 
You still gotta take the photo, come on. For now. I suggest we hurry. Arm Alpha in position. I don't even know this guy. I don't even know this guy or care about this guy. Oh, let's go, hair. Welcome to New York. Let's go, hair. <laughs> Defeat all the enemies? Hell yeah, I will. I hesitate to call this good news, but I'm seeing minimal Hydra resistance between you and the Sanctum. Can I? Looks can be deceiving, I'm afraid. There's no way these foot soldiers are behind the disruption of the wards of protection. Can I hit this? I have movement here. Just like an... Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, it's not good. I can vault it. I wanted to hit it at him. Well, that's no good. I thought for sure I could make that happen. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. All right, let's do... I got a slash, a quick attack. You know what? Blade, I'm going to use you. Shot a man. Kiss the mother with that mouth. Alright, hold on. Yes. 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 Now we're in it. Alright. Is this not I guess I can only vault and then attack this dude? Is that the vibe? We'll try it. I wanted to kick a thing, but you know, in life you can't always be kicking. But I can. Quick strike this dude. They're mine. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Knockback? Ooh. No mercy for the servants. Gadoosh! Big fan, big hey, fan. Draw one card, the next two damage cards deal two bleed. Yeah, okay. Should get the blood bumping. Doesn't really do anything to me, because it's the end of my turn. Jesse, use your brain next time, you big goober. Uh, although, although, hold on now. What's the vibe? What's the vibe of... Follow I'm gonna hit this Dr. Strange and go throw a newspaper at a man! Damn right he did. <laughs> That's unnecessary. <laughs> oh, and then he you shot Dr. Grave mistake. Be embarrassed by your weakness. He made me weak! Guards, get the hell out of here. That gamma spike we detected in your oh. area seems to be growing. Let's assume that's not a good thing. Draw gamma the last two not. cards. I, I can whip a dude, knock back in a here. random direction. Oh, discard a random card. Gotcha. No, all right. I don't want to do that. But I do want to do this.
You know, you beat me up pretty good. Okay. Fly weakness. And then will he? Son of a biscuit. Son of a biscuit. Okay. Let's do. Move. Can I move you to here? Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> what the. Shut up. Can I pull this off? Yes! That was awesome! Okay. Um. It was a waste, but that was fun. For Hydra. Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. <laughs> You're Hell lucky yes. To be Hell yes. Alright, and turn. Move back. I'll handle it. Appreciate that. How dare you? Wanda is calling out to me. I feel her struggle. You Restore health. And um. Ah. And I will. My hair is fabulous, baby. They have an answer for this. My slash has a knockback. Can I knock him? I don't know if heroism to bleed. Uh, let me do this. Maybe I can knock him to here. I want to knock him into the electricity for the sake of, of comedy gold. Level up! Coming Hell yeah, I gotta level up. Alright, Hunter, level two. Um... Blade's gonna jump in and literally kill this man. We're the heroes. Surprise, they all still have their heads. Misguided as they are, remember, Hydra is still human, Hunter. Not Lilin. <laughs> saying the lifeblood of the mother pumps through our veins the mother is eternal hydra is eternal on a bed
Defeat Fallen Venom. Fallen Venom symbiote binds can be broken. All right. Well, that certainly escalated quickly. Do I even want to know what that beast is? It's Venom. It calls itself Venom. The kids love Venom. Until now, a pale imitation of a very heroic young friend of mine. We will feed your ugly tongue to the spider wizard. Marinate it in his stomach juices and eat it with his spleen. You heard the man. I uh, heard cards in your hand, plus five damage until played or discarded. Big fan, big fan. Okay, how are we doing this? I guess we can go here. Maybe not. It's not going to hit him there. So. Yeah, why not? Of preparation. Knock back, haters! I am impressed. I liked it. Chain two on this idiot. Uh, we'll do it again. Big time. Get him, Blade. Hell yeah, level Looking up. Good, feeling good. Nice. Um, can I? Uh, can I take you, my man? Move you here. Yep, yep, that's what I want. Can I kick this? No, I'm vaulting. Ay, 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 ay. <gasps> no, that's a lot. Zero percent, huh? He won't fall off. Story of my life. Still. <laughs> Still. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm fighting giant idiots. Oh, he got me. Ugh, that punch left a residue. My hair. My beautiful hair. Fluid before. Reinforcements. They ran right by Doctor Strange. Like, we got him. Surrounded. All right, here's the real question. Can I Doctor Strange my ass to the and best? you belong to us. We shall start with your juicy entry. Your delicious brains. Are the rest of your mother's children so chatty? Thankfully, no. Are you serious? I don't. I don't have like a. I don't got. I don't got anything. All right. Well, we can do. Here to save you. Nice. Good work, Blade. That's why you're the hero, dude. That's why Blade's a badass. Alright. Alright. So I've got nothing to. Well. Hmm. How on earth? I mean, in theory, you can, like, come over to these, but I can't... The, the range is so small. And I can't knock him back into anything because I don't have any knockbacks. So, story of my life. Okay, so we're just going to have to, like, come up with some... Draw one card. Next two damage cards, apply two bleed. I only have... You can discard and redraw. I know, I know. I'm just trying to, like, make some stuff happen. Life steal, quick attack, huh? All right, we'll redraw this. Well, that's not what I wanted, but 
That's technically... Bleed is a bleed, you know what I'm saying? Oh shit, that guy flew away! Fragile, but not right. as fragile as you. Do I have any... Can I do any kind of fun... No, not really. All right, we'll sit tight, I guess. Ah, mono farms are for the weak. Whoa, whoa, leave Doctor. Doctor Strange is dead. Doctor Strange died today. Dude got electrocuted. Ow. He used the things against us. I could use some more practice. Oh, but he's bleeding. Stupid bleeding idiot. <clears throat> Cannot act on this turn. Well, I guess we it's fine that I have all these blade thing. abilities. Oh, my I goodness. Smarter to pull back until we know what we're up against here. No, 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 Blade got this. Some motherfuckers always trying to skate uphill or whatever the hell he says. Hmm. <laughs> Do I need lifesteal? Not really. I have two car plays? Alright, we'll do this again. Stupid, stupid exactly. dumb idiot. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Quick, quick. Bleed, 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 bleed. Let's do this. Um, bleed and lifesteal? No, we'll just do this. Get bleeded again. I point blank range shot Venom. Damn right I did. I Get it, Blade. Whoops, stun removed. Whoops, stun removed. Okay. First you die, then we eat. Leave, Tasty. leave my beautiful haired man alone. Ay, ay, ay. thing has been trapped. Get out of there, Matt Mercer. We have our limits. Is he spiked up? So I probably no physical attacks. Although my dude be bleeding. That's nice. Mother blesses us with power. Enemy area Mother attacks will go off at the end of the turn. Oh, so this is I gotta get out. Okay. Alright, that's not good. And are rewarded with your meat. And to think Lilith was a vegetarian. Okay, he's good. I hope this is one of the stronger arms. We did come all the way here and for then a we'll do this. Into this. So you're not gonna bounce and hit me, huh? Story of my life. Although, it's not about the bounce and hit. I am a sorcerer supreme. Hell yes. Um, let's do... I don't want to apply bleed on anything. We'll redraw this. Give me something good. Or that. I would love to get some heals for Doctor Strange, but, you know, I guess we're not doing that. Um, Watch me. Did my man just run out of the... Bless his sweet soul. All right, and that's gone. But apparently, lifesteal is where I'm at, I guess. Um, what is his life at? No, I'm not going to deal with that. It's a waste of a card, but, like, whatever. It's fine. I'm not going to stake. I'm not going to do anything. I'll save that and turn. You are within our reach. Leave this man alone. 
reinforcements. I'm fine. I'm, I'm just trying to, like, show some cool stuff. This dude's almost dead. Okay, you heal. Your friends cannot help I got you, Dr. Strange. That's my hair heal. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it's time for smacking that bitch up. Is it going to hit him? It's not going to hit. Ah, what a disappointment. All right, it's fine. You have earned this. I thought it was going to hit both. But they just died at his feet. You were too weak for this fight. I guess we'll end it. Oh, he's not even ended it yet. That's fine. This is Get in there, Blade! <laughs> that was awesome looking. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I thought he did before, but I forgot they look different. I forgot they look different. I'm going to move him behind this. Bye, hater. No blade, no! Get this thing off me! You thought you could defeat my beautiful hair? More reinforcements, eh? <laughs> We killed Venom with boredom. Okay. Oh. No escape from me, demon. Hold up. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. Have you seen my hair? Friendly. Seemed like you folks could use a hand, Doc. <coughs> Spider Man! Jeez, oh, Eddie, what happened to you? That's part of a horrifyingly terrible new look. The tongue was gross enough, but. Whoa! Someone is extra touchy today. We will rip your face off and suck the pearl from your bones! Always nice to see you too, buddy. So, I'm thinking your friends here could use a little break. How about I take Eddie here for his afternoon walk? <laughs> Don't worry, Doc. That's just his way of saying he cares! I love Spider-Man. Victory! You nailed it! Two whole stars. Congratulations. New world or not, some things remain unchanged. The look. What look? Boldly charging headfirst into the jaws of your enemy. Courageously risking the lives of yourself and your teammates. Just to play the hero. This is the Fire Dragon all over again. Fire Dragoon. My memories may be fragmented, but as I recall, I killed the bastard. And all it cost was a village. Oh, of course. I see it now. The look. Cut him some slack. It wasn't that simple. It never is. Which is why I sent you to help. If Spider-Man hadn't come along today, we could have lost far more than... Than the Sanctum? Or Wanda. She means I could have died. Again, putting an end to her eternal crusade against my mother. You've been through a lot.
for now. It's enough that you all <laughs> the hair taker. <laughs> more or less. I've never been more proud of a hairstyle in any game. I'm so happy this is what we we'll picked. Talk more later. This is Get some rest. fabulous hair. Uh, greetings, Germany. I've never been more pleased with a hair choice ever, period. Also, by the way, exclamation point. Midnight Suns, if you want to learn not where you can pick this game up or more about the game. I told you not to push too hard. Now that things have settled down, you should get some rest. It won't always be this quiet. Okay. Oh, hey, fellers. That was a complete fiasco. And it would have been far worse had Spider-Man not arrived when he did. No kidding. Caretaker would have been pissed if Venom had actually eaten the hunter. Yes, one did that. Oh, hey, what's going on, Tony? Hey, for what it's worth, I think you did okay out there. You got some decent hang time, even uh, given you were wearing, what, 70, 80 pounds of chain mail? On the stark scale of reckless yet daring heroics, I give it a solid 6 out of 10. Don't worry, you'll get there, with a little help. <laughs> get where? And where exactly am I going? Oh, that's the real question, isn't it? Sky's the limit for you, my friend. <laughs> Unless you'd be up for wearing a space helmet. You do breathe air, don't you? You know what? It doesn't matter. I, I couldn't help but overhear Auntie Caretaker over there telling you to get some rest. That uh, sounds like a good idea to me. I suppose I could keep you company on the way, seeing as our rooms are in the same direction and all. Besides, no one should be forced to walk the hallways around here alone. Tony, are you flirting with the hunter's beautiful hair? So, here we are. The old room, huh? It's, uh, it's not bad. Functional. Solid construction. Almost cozy. Love the antique furnishings from the early Mephisto collection. Full transparency, Hunter. There's another reason I asked to join you here, other than my abject terror of this entire facility. Stopped here before, while you were out. Wanted to surprise you with a nice little housewarming present. Was all set to write you a lovely welcome note, but I'm fairly certain that wasn't red ink in your quill. Joke, Quill. What Quill? But I do not have a Quill. Even better. <laughs> Relax, Tony. I simply jest. It is an ink derived of the spider lily flower. Red spider lily flowers. Of course it was. Obviously. With just a touch of Manphibian blood for power. Speaking of Manphibian... Haha! <laughs> Another zinger. And we'll just leave it at that. Well, I suppose I should leave before whatever monstrosity that is most definitely hiding under your bed jumps out, rips my face off, and then proceeds to feast on my soul. I'll leave you to it. May your sleep be filled with pleasant dreams, Tony. Right back at you. Oh, and if you hear the shrieking of a grown man, please ignore it. It's just me, walking to my room. Our new hero available! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I got a present. Open Tony's present. Hi, I'm Tony Stark. But if you're hearing this message, you already know that. When I'm not saving the world, I solve the world's problems with technological means, like the one you're holding. I call it the Spark, a secure information and communication device built only for superheroes. It does all the usual, private messages, pictures, and calls for some reason. But it also comes with access to Superlink, a private social network exclusively for your cape-wearing, world-saving compatriots. You might ask, Tony, aren't you just repurposing a failed product from your communications division? If you do, I'll revoke access and let everyone else know you're a jerk. I call it the Wonder Man rule. Hey, Robbie Reyes has a new post. First post. You want to do that, right, Blade? Right, Blade? <laughs> I love a good goof. Oh, look at this. Magic, you got to stop being like that. You got to stop being so dramatic. Look at my favorite things and a map of the things and a map of the things. Common chest, common chest. Can't open nothing. Great common chest. What happened to my uh, uncommon chest? Is it not going to show it? 
What the heck, you Becky? <laughs> so we got Blade being Blade. We got Doctor Strange. We got Iron Man. And then this beautiful human. Look at this sweet, sweet cherub. This is where I shall sleep. Here. There was never enough room for my armor in this thing. <laughs> no. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> yes. Athletic Hunter. Common white t-shirt hunter. Gray. You know what? Something about this outfit screams. This is so funny to me. This outfit. <laughs> this one is so funny to me. He's like tight, tight pants. No socks. It's so good. <laughs> is there a sweater vest option? I don't think so. Although, this one's even funnier. This one's a little too Iron Man for me. I don't want Tony to think I'm stealing his look. I'm going for sweater. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Hello, everyone. It's me. Yes, I'm looking great. We were all so happy then. Hmm. Hmm. Some sort of Agatha Harkness character in here. What do you mean? It's me. Matthew Mercer. And Sarah wants me to practice my letters. So here I am. But every time I dip this pen in ink... By the way, can we talk about for a minute? The fact... Look. In the MCU. They're making a Blade movie. Agatha already exists. Black Knight already exists. Um, we can easily cast a Robbie Reyes. Uh, we apparently already have a Nico that exists. All I'm saying is, we could even include Morbius, T TBH. All I'm saying is, Midnight Suns would be a, a, like, for those of you who don't know, like, Dark Marvel is pretty cool. Dark Marvel is pretty cool. So if you, I'm just saying, if they want to go that route, Doctor Strange is even in it a little bit. We uh, everyone in chat told me that Nico, the Nico in this game is the Nico from a TV show that I'm clearly not watching. Also, we have Moon Knight, and Moon Knight is 100% in um, uh, my brain just died in Midnight Suns. Like, we could. All right, look, Marvel Cinematic Universe, <clears throat> pulling off the cover because it's that important. Okay. Jon Snow, who is Black Knight, his girlfriend got taken by gods or some nonsense. So, I want Midnight Suns, the Marvel movie, <laughs> to be all these characters that go to space and kill space gods. Thank you. Now you might say, Jesse, that's the stupidest idea ever. Is it? Would you like to see Blade in a space helmet? Because I certainly would. I would love to see Blade in space. I would love to see Blade in a space helmet. <laughs> More than you know. More than you know. We're coming for you, Galactus. <laughs> I would be there opening night. That shit would be fire. <laughs> My old journal. Maybe old it is journal. time I start writing in it again. Maybe. I guess I'm sleeping. <laughs> this guy's beautiful. Stop her! 
Big fan of the name drops. Only I can stop her. Why does he have this hair? Because I chose him to. Child. Oh, what up, demon dog? Charlie. How you doing? I know, I know. I, I missed you too. Let her enjoy the moment. She's been visiting your door every morning for the past 300 years. Oh, it must have been so hard on her. Not just her. I suppose that's why I might have been a little curt before. A little? You already made the ultimate sacrifice once. Maybe I'm in no rush to see you do it again. We do not choose our destiny. But we can choose to duck. <laughs> First lesson you ever taught me, Kat. And still the most important. Especially now that you have all these eyes on you. I have noticed. To these people, you are a being of myth and legend. A grand hero of old. And they're right. You are a hero. But I also know the battle that rages within your soul. It's not enough that you are a hero. You need to decide what type of hero you will be. The kind that flirts I'm with Tony sure Stark, apparently. There will be opportunity for that in the days to come. For now, I would head to the forge. Our new guests are eager to show you something. This was a lot easier when it was just you and I beheading the Dark Legion as we traipsed through the woods. Don't forget about Agatha. I never could. Yeah, I was about to say. Hard to. Hey, that explains why we have this Charlie doggy bed. Oh, do you want me to pet the doggo? We'll talk more later, but for now, Stark has requested your presence in the forge. I think he has another present for you. Good girl, Charlie. You know, oh, love up. You know how. You know how some people buy sports cars? You know how some people, like, start dating, like, 20-year-olds? Is my midlife crisis that I create a character with this beautiful hair? <laughs> Is my midlife crisis that I made this guy so I can live vicariously through his beautiful head of hair? <laughs> because I'm okay with it. Because I'm okay with it. I'm not sure we've ever had so many eager new recruits come along in such a short time. We must be doing something right. I love it. Oh, hey. What's up, Cap? Let's talk later, Hunter. What's up, Cap? Tony will start pouting if you keep him waiting too long. Blade? Heard you had a nightmare. In the words of Agami Ito, don't be afraid. Bad dreams are only dreams. Damn, dude, blew my mind. Uh oh. I don't get it. Credits. So just magic his way in. Heroic essence. Something Robbie, what's up? Heard about what happened in New York, Hunter. I'm sure whatever Tony's cooking up down there will only help. What's up, Nico? Up. Not that it makes any difference to me, but I think Tony's waiting for you, Hunter. He seemed excited. Uh, fine. Well, Tony can wait while I look around. If y'all keep telling me to go to Tony. So I'm gonna much. find secrets then. No wonder he gets so strange around me. See what I did there? I'm a vampire. I see it. <laughs> I'm a vampire. I see everything. Can I go for a jog down this path? I'm like jogging down this path in my fine ass pants. Is something I need. Oh, what's down here? <laughs> this guy, look at this fabulous tush this man has. That is, you could bounce $25 off of that damn thing. <laughs> That's a fine ass that man has. You keep bouncing. 
Whoop, there we go. Evening in the woods, masterwork. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Another portal, sure. Oh, hey, but, but I shouldn't touch that. They got me looking for stuff that's truly unimportant, but I don't care. I must have it all. And, sure, you're probably saying, Jesse, you're just watching this flowing hair and beautiful buns move around the world? Yeah, maybe. Maybe I am. What's it to you? What's it to you? Do you think there's something back up here by where I woke up? This could easily be the entirety of the sponsor stream. People would buy it. People would buy the game for this little... Look at this. This dude went and shopped at, like, Lululemon or something, and no one told him that, like, he probably shouldn't, but he don't give a damn. He's like, I don't even care if when I stretch you can see through these pants. Doesn't bother me. I got nothing to hide. If anything, I'm proud. Nope, that's just Jeremiah Kane. Interesting. Kane's. Interesting. Jeremiah Kane. Super interesting. Oh, there's the cliff again. That's not helpful. What do we got over here? Nothing new. Thought that was lizards, but that's just twigs. My little tush. Oh, do you think there's something down here? Woo! Hello, person's room. Continue. Uh, well, obviously we're going to put, for this room, we're going to put this common masterwork here. Uh-oh. Yes, 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 yes. E to confirm. That looks good. Yeah, that's fine. And then here, yeah. Sure. Very nice. Very, super nice. Just the best. Look at me, just giving everyone the power of art. Now, I should get on I should get on the internet because if my this dude saw fan art, he'd be like, "Oh my. The Daily Blue Bluegle? That's right. The Daily Bluegle. Spider-Man and his amazing friends unleash monster upon city." Garish. <laughs> Who runs this paper? Mephisto? Almost. I actually think that'd be an amazing Oh, I want to see what Nico said. I think that would be an amazing plot twist for the MCU. Is if Mephisto was J. Jonah Jameson. Just saying. Alright, anyway, where are we? Astounding Spider-Man. Okay, can't get that. Sometimes you... Ooh, that's Hi, my room. Kiddo. Caretaker. Everyone. I'm gonna go this way. Snoop. Yes. Essence. Essence for me. I'm hearing you magic things. Do you think my guy would understand the concept of a computer? Could I... Can I be like... I need to log in to check my AOL. They still have that, right? Now? Think you can tell your friend inside there to turn it up a few hundred Kelvin? I could. However, it might shatter the containment spell preventing him from incinerating this facility. Uh, I think we're good. And just in time. The forge okay. has certainly changed. Right. Caretaker said this all happened after your siesta. What spooky castle would be complete without its own Babylonian demon-powered furnace? Sumerian fire demon. His name is Babs. Oh, now it all makes sense. Well, once you get past the esoteric terror of the situation, I've found this thing actually has some uses. Molecular bonding, breaking down evil gamma serums, fashion accessorizing. Mm, yes, speaking of... Oh, right. It's ready. Your armor seemed to offer minimal protection against the Venom creature. I noticed. Yeah, I thought you could use an upgrade. Well hammered, well fired. 
caretaker did not mention that you two were such skilled smithies. Yep, I am Iron Smithy. Perhaps you should just try it on. I just put on this new shirt. I just put on a whole new outfit. Oh man. Still think I could have used a cloak. Damn near indestructible. And we even got the size right. Not bad for our first collaboration. That's what is the map? Oh. Right, okay. You think everything could benefit from a cloak? Anything else to look at or take or use in a some way? Yes, there is. Nice. Good, oh, good, good look out, Jesse. Tone, what's up? Uh to admit it, but somehow this ancient forge puts any arc reactor I've got to shame. Who would have thought mystically bound demon power would be so damn energy efficient? Or carbon neutral? Certainly got that new suit of yours done a lot faster than I expected. Speaking of, what's the verdict, boss? Um, thanks. I appreciate the effort. It is nice having an armorer on demand. Anytime. I tried to make this version a little less palatable. That's plus one. Tony's gonna this, fall this in love to with me, and then I'm gonna be yeah, like, "Sorry, the tools are Tone." Just one part of the equation. You gotta know how to use them too. You were out what? The only person I love. Years before we woke you from my your eternal rest. I'm betting you have questions, so ask away, Hunter. Um. I take it this new version is a technological marvel. Impact-resistant carbon composites, some patent-pending alloy mesh, and a few touches from Dr. Spooky over there. And hey, the built-in communicator means we can talk to each other without sending a raven. I don't know what half those words are, but I think there's an insult buried in there. No, I'm going to say impressive. So it is a marvel, then? Lightweight, nearly indestructible, and modular enough for future upgrades. Frankly, I wouldn't have used your old suit to wax the Mandarin's car. Is all this magic a threat to your new technology? I might surprise some people to hear this, but I do like some things with rules. Isotope decay, magnetic fields, and gamma oscillation make a lot more sense to me than eye of newt, bat wings, and a sprinkle of sunshine. <sighs> At least they did before everything changed. So why is your best friend a wizard then? <laughs> but I'm asking you and it. The doctor seem to work well together. Oh no, need to put a label on things. The guy is good at making sense of this madness every now and then. He's not talking to his cape. Seen anything strange around here? What other than my roommate? Boom! Roasted. But on a more serious note, this place is legitimately haunted. Mirrors look back at you. My room rearranges itself. And worst of all, magic cats. A black cat? Was it suspiciously elusive, even for a cat? Actually, yes. Thought I was going crazy there for a second, but clearly I'm still firing on all cylinders. It just poofed in next to me out in the yard. Small, black, furry. Cute little thing. Probably some kind of shape-shifting monster knowing this place. What sort of things are you doing in here? Oh, that's right. You were out a while. Basically, we've got a gigantic demon inside the magic box here that provides near limitless power for whatever we might need. Sounds insane, but sometimes it's easier to just go with it. Uh, that sounds amazing. I am impressed with your resourcefulness. From where you're standing, I could see that. Still, I doubt I'll be branding one of these with the Stark Industries logo anytime soon. You must have an interesting origin story of your own. Well, just your typical American boy. Pops was a founding member of the military industrial complex. Mom, a famous socialite. Tragedy struck when I lost them both in a car crash, which turned out to be a hit from a rival corporation. I spent my early teens at MIT, trying to clear my head. It 
was all set to follow in Dad's footsteps as a war profiteer. Then one day, fortune shined on me, in the form of some errant shrapnel that lodged itself just above my heart. So I did what anybody in that situation would do. I built a super suit and started fighting crime. <laughs> That's a lot to deal with. Uh, I guess it all worked out in the end, question mark? You seem well adjusted enough, considering. Exactly, which means there's hope for you yet. I find these apocalypse scenarios will save you tons of therapy. Thanks for catching me up on things. Anytime. Oh, and speaking of things, remember that uh, creepy gamma goop you found from that hopped up Hydra soldier? Well, I gave it a peek and it explains a lot. If you have a minute, meet me at the anvil over there and I'll walk you through it. I promise it'll be worth your time. Analyze Gamma Goo. Hunter, your new attire suits you quite well. But how are you holding up on the inside? I know it's easy to look upon me and simply see the universe's utmost authority on all things mystical and macabre, Hunter. However, in addition to being Earth's Sorcerer Supreme, I am also your doctor. You mean a physician of the medical arts? You jest. I assure you, Hunter, I do not jest. They don't call me Mr. Strange, now do they? Except for Tony. Your awakening ritual was admittedly a touch more chaotic than I had originally intended, and, well, after your violent encounter with Venom, my oath to Hippocrates compels me to check in with you. Simply put, how do you feel? I'm honestly more worried about you. Go for those points. You lost much yesterday, Doctor. I am the one who should be asking you how you are feeling. I appreciate that, Hunter. I admit I did not expect the child of Lilith to have the capacity for such empathy. And you're right, of course. I, for one, do not know if I will ever feel 100% again after the events of yesterday. I still can't believe what transpired, the sanctum, all that knowledge, Wanda, lost, swallowed whole by the black mouth of that foul venom creature. With all my resources, all my gifts, I should have seen this outcome spelled out in the sacred geometry of this universe years ago, but I miscalculated. Lilith's power has placed a dark shroud over us all, Doctor. You are not alone in this. Your words are appreciated. Baby. Still, we must not allow the underlying Baby. truth of the situation to become shrouded as well. Well, well, it's not well. just the sanctum sanctorum that was lost yesterday. It was my protege, Wanda. She was, is, my charge, my responsibility, and I failed her. But I am determined not to let that happen with you, Hunter, which is why I am here to answer any questions you may have. Perhaps my wisdom may benefit you more than it has me thus far. A creature on the roof. You have run into it before. Unfortunately, yes. In the simplest of terms, Venom is an alien species living in symbiosis with a human known as Eddie Brock. He's something of a fixture in New York these days, but typically his hijinks are confined to harassing Spider-Man. I love that it's like, yeah, that Venom guy just harasses Spider-Man. That's like his hijinks. My mother has a gift for bringing out the worst in people. Yes, and in this case, I happen to be the direct victim of her ambition. I fear the sanctum may never be the same. Tell me about your sanctum's wards of protection. I have never heard of a protection spell that powerful. In your time, I'm sure you encountered a variety of minor wards and protective spells. The Sanctum Sanctorum was shielded by one such incantation, but greatly amplified by the convergence of ley lines. Um... Yeah, I'll ask. 
Will the wards ever provide the same protection that they had? It may be possible to undo the damage, but now that a weakness has been exposed, I'll have to rethink my approach entirely. Tony did offer a military-grade laser protection grid, should I be so inclined to go that route. What are you- are you- what are you saying? You don't like my beautiful hair? You don't like the fact that this man's hair is voluptuous? <laughs> How did Wanda come into your care? Wanda's story is quite tragic and perhaps not mine to tell. There was an accident on the Abbey grounds not long ago involving Agatha. I feel like everyone is avoiding mention of Agatha. I can't say I'm surprised, but I'm afraid it's really not my place. You should speak to Sarah about her when you're ready. Okay, well, I'll leave now. Let us talk later. Yes, let us Visit talk Visit whenever later. you like. It's not often I get to converse with a true legend. I feel like you're all mocking my beautiful hair. Frankly, I'm not, I, you know what? I'm not, I don't know why you would, I don't know why you would say that. Mm. Hey, you took your shades off. Guess I can put away the garlic. Won't do much good against Hydra. Put away the shades, baby. All right, we'll go here. Fine. Speak. Do you have anything to say to me? Sorry? Always on the hunt. Ay, yeah, yeah. Okay. Just trying to figure out what I can and can't do. Oh, it's Fabio? No, this is the hunter. <laughs> Fabio wishes he could be the hunter. Okay, gamma coil analysis. Now, I doubt advanced gamma thermodynamics was a hot topic at ye olde demon hunting school, so I'm just going to give you the condensed version. I appreciate that. Closest I've ever seen to this substance is pumping through Bruce's veins. Part gamma accelerant, part unknown element. Calling it coil for now, given its unique atomic structure. Man, I love acronyms. This stuff is more volatile than Nick Fury on a Monday morning. But Hydra doesn't seem to mind. They're using it to get stronger. Exactly. A few drops would make your average salamander look like Fin Fang Foom. Is that a Fin Fang Foom reference? Dr. Spooky and our haunted oven over here. <laughs> I think two can play at this game. You are not Wherever you're at, Fing Fang Foom, we miss you. Ourselves with it. No, 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 no. Nothing like that. Though I can see some future applications for my energy drink line. I was thinking we apply this stuff towards upgrading our equipment. I like where this is going. Just give me a little time here and I can whip up some pretty fun toys. How about we give Hydra a taste of their own gamma-powered medicine for a change? So, how's the whole saving the world thing going? E to analyze. This should be quick. I feel like I can automate this process and take myself out of the loop here. Take your pick, Hunter. Ooh, middle. I did say middle. We'll stick with middle. Even though I want the whip, I did say middle. Hunter, when you have a minute, come meet me in the yard. Running with my beautiful hair. They really, they really be posting too much. I'm over here trying to do. Ooh. Um, I don't need to edit my deck at all, at all. Vampire double feature tonight. Let's go. I swear to God that said, 
How about Duchess of the Damned and Skank? And I was like, Skank? I don't know if that's the right movie. <laughs> no shank for me. Other than that, I'm in. They weaponize garlic. It's dumb. <laughs> mm, I love it. <laughs> 